Arbiter. One is curious about your choice this time. Wherever the tides may take us, you will bear witness to our fight. Government must be guided by virtue. Chi, do you keep this in mind? Yes. Virtue must come first. Politics, commerce, it all must serve the people. From now on, you shall be known as Jinshi, bearing Jinjo's name as your own. What do you think of this world? Like... here. Darkness clings, but lights flicker in the gloom. A guiding light is easily lit. <laughs> That's why they stand out so brightly against the darkness. leads to one Sonoro Sphere. Magistrate Jinshi, one shall await you there. Rover, this battle is related to the fate of Jinjo, and only you can open this Sonoro Sphere. The key to Jinjo's future lies in your hands. If I open it, Jinshi is bound to face you in the ultimate battle. The ideal outcome would be for her to absorb your power at the critical moment and restore the time flow without any loss of life. But there's a chance that she could push herself too far and end up dying from overclocking. Though, if I do nothing, you'll use your remaining power to freeze all of Jinjo in time. Correct. Right. Now, please let us know your choice. Rover. I have been preparing for this moment. Leaving Jinjo behind fills me with regret. Knowing I may never again bask in its glorious sunshine, or witness the purity of its snowflakes. But that's why I'm here. To ensure that others can still experience the wonders of nature. Our city has a rich history, with generations witnessing endless sunrises and sunsets at the border. Our people have sacrificed their blood and tears to protect Huanglong's safety. They deserve a bright future. I want to protect Jinjo in my own way. As Jinshi, as a citizen of Jinjo, and as Jinjo's magistrate. Let's begin.
May I pray for anything? Quite the impressive feat, Magistrate Jinchi. However, you are still a long way from inheriting my power. Back down now, while you still can. I've made up my mind, and I will not back down. He once said it's not easy to become a candle of light, but I still want to try. I want to see if I can ignite a spark of hope for Jinjo. Arbiter. <gasps> May this one transfer the temporal mandate to Jin Shi. This one has heard your decision. The transfer has been carried out, as you instructed. Jinshi, one shall honor one's promise, and restore Jinjo's future to you and its people.
You down the stair? Jinshi has recovered. One will soon send her back to Jinjo for recuperation. Please do not worry. With all matters resolved, as per the agreement, it is time for one to address you. One is prepared to answer any inquiries you may have. I am Jue the Sentinel. The guide of Jinjo's civilization. Everything about Jinjo has been stored in my mind. You are my arbiter and my former master. In bygone days, I stood by your side as you established Jinjo City. You tasked me with safeguarding its prosperity. This one begs your pardon, for it is not all-knowing. All my knowledge came from you. One is prepared to answer any inquiries you may have. In the past, one was granted the key to that Sonoro Sphere by your hand. You said you planned to participate in history, to make choices and witness the development of civilizations. One had previously requested for permission to transfer the temporal mandate to Jinshi, as that is how one is designed to function. Every ounce of my existence, from life to death, and even the passing on of power, is subject to your approval. One is prepared to answer any inquiries you may have. Your tacit mark. There is something unusual. It smells like the unnatural smell I smelled in Jinjo before. Oh, so you must be that sentinel. <laughs> Hello there, big one. Rover, why didn't you wake me up earlier? I got a feeling I missed out on a lot of fun. It does feel similar to me, but there is some difference. This entity is unfamiliar to me. As it resides within your tacit mark, one can only assume you granted it access intentionally. Lady Arbiter. Have you heard of the Black Shores? The Black Shores is the starting point of your journey in this world. If you have doubts, 
This one suggests a visit to that island. Worry not. The weathering waves ebb and flow. They shall send you back to where you belong. One suggests heading back to Hongzhen to reunite with your companions, Lady Arbiter. With Mount Firmament no longer posing a threat, surely Hongzhen will undergo significant changes. <laughs>